My name is Kenzie Horton. I am a graduate student at Jacksonville University in the Marine Science Research Institute. Uh, I'm looking at the space use and movements and migrations of the white sharks when they're in their overwintering residency area, which is right off the coast of the Carolinas. So the Carolinas is an important region for these white sharks. It promotes a lot of life, so we're seeing lots of different fish, turtles, dolphins in this region. And this area has a lot of different food items for them, and we're seeing these sharks kind of utilize this area all the way from the continent into the shelf edge where the Gulf Stream is. This area is actually a secondary nursery and overwintering nursery for the young of years, but we're seeing juveniles, subadults, and adults utilize this area. They're either staying here for a period of time or can continue moving south towards Georgia and Florida for their overwintering phase, but they seem to come back here at, certain, at a certain time. And that's what I'm seeing from the spot and the acoustic data, trying to get these adult sharks. Because these adult males and females, we can really get a good idea on what they're doing, and especially if we're looking at these hypothesized mating regions. 